Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna give you guys a warning right off the rip, man. This is, um, this is bad. And when I mean bad, this is like inducing vomit bad in some ways, but Jesus, oh, Jesus, man. It, you guys just, you're not ready for it, I'm telling you. Like, you've clicked on this video, you want to see the room, I understand. But you, you don't realize how far it's gonna go. How far into the literal rat trap you're about to go. I'm dead serious. This room's on a completely different level, folks. Like, you know, I feel like a lot of us, we, we, I mean, like, even myself, I've had messy rooms. I've had outright disgusting rooms in the past, right? A lot of teenage guys have messy rooms. I understand that. I've been to a lot of my friends' houses. Their rooms are generally somewhat messy. I feel like if you play video games or, like, you know, you're kind of in, like, the same little area for most of your free time, it, you're also a little bit more prone to maybe being messy there, but, um, this isn't like a messy desk or anything, this is just a disgusting room. So today we're going to be taking a look at a Twitch streamer, okay, who has l quite literally one of the literally most disgusting rooms I've ever seen. I, I had to say literally twice in the same sentence, folks. It it's it's bad. So this Twitch streamer goes by the online persona of, I think, Jägermeister, okay? And yesterday he broadcasts on Twitch, okay, and reveals that he has not cleaned his bedroom since moving into his house 14 years ago. 14 years, okay, we're not talking like a week, two weeks, a month, six months, 14 years. It's ridiculous, man, like, this is one of the just worst bedrooms I've ever seen, like, food wrappers, okay, literally just exploding trash bags piled in the corners. You quite literally cannot see a single piece of carpet on his floor, okay? You can't see any of it. It's almost so bad that it looks like he has a green screen of garbage on his floor. It's, it's just insane. Like, you have to wade through the garbage to get to his bed. With that being said, okay, I'm going to show you guys some video clips, okay, and then we're gonna talk about this. I'm just warning you, okay, it's pretty disgusting. If you don't have a strong stomach, okay, I really do, and I'm being serious, I recommend you get something, like a trash can, something. Get ready, because you really might throw up. Wow! <laughs> Yo, those are from 2017! Just oh my, my dude, you're gonna have to nuke everything. You're gonna have to take all your <laughs> streaming equipment, like your computer, take it out of the room and just nuke your room, dude. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move my, like, green scenes, green screen setup out of my room right now. You're gonna have to wash that thing. Yeah, probably. I'll just run it, I'll just run the green screen in the washing machine, dude. Yeah, that'll work. <laughs> Did you just see what I saw? He literally held up a bag of food that has been sitting in his room since 2017. I don't know if we're all on the Gregorian calendar. It's 2019. This dude has literally had the same bag of food sitting in his room for two years. It wasn't like it like slid under his bed and he never could find it. This has been sitting in plain sight for two years. And did you notice another thing that I noticed? When he walked over by his green screen, he smelled it and then started to cough. The smell of that green screen was so pugnant and, 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 and messed with him so badly that he gagged. For the love of God, okay, this is just... I can't imagine. This was like that show Hoarders on TV. You know, some of those houses are just as bad if not worse, but you're literally looking at 14 years of garbage laying in somebody's room, okay? And this isn't even the worst of it, trust me. The next couple of clips you see are gonna really show how bad this situation is. Dude. Yes. Um, okay, hold How on, but I have, you have to do this. How you have long to do this song. Wait, you have to play this song. How long did it, did Wait, Dextero? Asmin's Am I gonna have a f Dextero oh, yeah, article about me? Oh, sh What the f What exactly do you expect? I mean, look at this sh Man, this is insane. So Dextero, which is only just one of like the major people who ended up watching this stream, donates this money, and then he like is almost shocked that they're about to report on it. It's like, dude, this is just, it's so far gone, you know? So then they ask him, like, you know, how did it get this bad? Because I think it's a fair question to ask, like, how do you live in that environment 
for over a decade and not clean at all. Like this fool probably literally has Happy Meals from his childhood laying on his floor that he steps on every single day. Well, apparently he moved into this house in like 2004, okay, which has been 15 years. And he has never cleaned his room once. And here's another thing, okay? This man is 20 years old. He is a year older than me. Has never cleaned his bedroom once in his entire life. What the hell, man? That's just, it's sad, okay? It's sad because you know, like, if you look at what he's doing, he's like almost celebrating this. This is like an accomplishment to him. He like sees this as something almost to be proud of, it seems. Like he's like celebrating how much garbage he has in this room. Like, oh, you know, look at me, man. I haven't cleaned my room in 14 years. But you're about to see the literal mother load of garbage in his room. Like, you, you know, you can see all the food wrappers and the bags and stuff like that laying around the floor, which is almost, it seems, as tall in some spots as his bed is in the back corner of the room. But what you're about to see is just absolutely revolting, and I, I, I just don't understand how you let it get to that point. Oh, dude. As been cold watching. Fuck you. Ugh. All right, so how did it get to this stage? Basically, I moved into this house in like 2004, 2005, and I didn't clean it. And now it's this bad. Asmongold actually watching, I'm showing him the trash pile, dude. I'm showing him the left side. There we go, boys, it's over there. That's about a two meters deep of trash. There it is, boys, see that shit? Peak wild gameplay. He's watching the clip. He's watching the clip. Oh, the clip? Dude, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That is trash bags full of garbage, and um, he revealed that it is two meters tall. Okay? Now, I live in the United States. Don't necessarily know too much about meters. I understand. You know, it's just a little bit over three feet. So I'm six foot one. Okay, and I wanted to see if that was taller. Well, apparently his pile of trash bags is six, is actually, I'm sorry, over six and a half feet tall. His garbage pile has height on me. That is just, it's unacceptable to, to, ver to say the least. That is just unacceptable. This is garbage from the last 14 years just that's actually taller than me. It's taller than you. If you went into this dude's room, you would literally be overcasted by the shadow of his garbage in the corner. How don't you see a problem with that? You know, how, how do you find that as something that that's almost like an accomplishment? You know, I'm... I'm trying to process it, like, what about that makes you think, like, yeah, man, look how much trash has piled my corner. Now that a bunch of people are watching me, and one of the most popular, apparently, uh, like, one of the most popular World of Warcraft streamers was watching at the time. Yeah, now that he's watching, let me show off my real accomplishment here, you know, my two-meter-tall trash pile in the corner. Can you imagine the smell in that? Apparently, another highlight of his garbage emporium is a, uh, is a big pot with molded mac and cheese. That uh, apparently looks like literal feces. He didn't show this, but I, I wouldn't show it if he did. Okay, it just, the description's enough for me. Now, apparently the reason that he wants to clean up his room now isn't because, you know, there's a garbage pile taller than him in the corner, not because he's got 2007 McDonald's promotional material laying on the floor. It's apparently because it's his birthday. That was his reason for cleaning up his room. It's his birthday. Now, I, I will say, at least he's cleaning it up, you know? At least he's finally made the decision to clean this shit up. But it still doesn't... I have so many questions. First question, how do you let it get this bad? I understand having a messy room, you know? I, I get it. I really do. I've had messy-ass rooms for a long time, too. Number two, okay? And this is my real question here, okay? So, he streams. That, that much is apparent. He live streams on Twitch. This is what, you know, the whole thing came from was a Twitch live stream. Now he has a webcam angled where you can see all of this. So you're telling me people have been watching him for God knows how long now, seeing all that and no one's raised this question before? No one has seen this garbage pile ever? He's not embarrassed to let people see that, you know? 
I just don't necessarily get some of this. Like, it just does, some of this is not making sense to me. It's not registering with me. Like, none of his viewers ever had any concern about this ever before. He never had a concern about this until apparently it was just his birthday one day and he decides, hey, maybe I should get all this shit out of my room. Now, apparently, uh, he believes that his reasoning for letting this get so bad is that he has a mental disorder. Now, he doesn't know if he has one or not, but I mean, I would say this is a pretty good candidate to diagnose him with one. I, I would say something, you know? There's all kinds of disabilities and stuff I would think of could make him be this, I guess, uh, repulsive is a good word. But the next quote that I'm about to read is the one that, uh, that I really think you guys are gonna enjoy, okay? He says, and I quote, in a private message to Dextero, who reported on this whole thing, I would like to advise anyone who doesn't already play World of Warcraft to avoid the game at all costs, else they have a room like mine. There we go. It, it didn't seem right. It didn't seem natural that the video game wasn't being blamed for the problem here. Of course it's World of Warcraft's fault that he has over a decade of garbage built up inside of his room. Of course. Why wouldn't it be his inability to manage his time playing a video game, you know? It, of course. Course, it's got to be the video game itself. Apparently, if you play World of Warcraft, regardless, you know, you're going to have a room like this. You're going to have a trash pile that could play in the NBA. Wasn't necessarily uh, too certain about that, but yeah, apparently that that's what he said. So yet again, it's the video game's fault, man. It, it's perfect. It, 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 the weird thing about this, this time, it's not like some phony ass medical professional who doesn't understand what they're talking about. It, it's not some mom who like refuses to take responsibility for their child. It's the person playing the game themselves, dude. I have never seen this happen before in any of these videos, ever, not once. This is a historical moment in our channel's history, folks. With all this being said, you've seen the room, you've seen how disgusting it is, you've seen how shameful this whole thing is. You know, let me know what you think down below about this. If you're interested in watching him clean this room up, apparently you can do so by watching his Twitch channel. I'll leave a link down below so you can, uh, you can see it. It, I mean, there, there's, um, there's two videos that are over two hours long already uploaded in the last 24 hours from his streams. Countless clips, including some very disgusting things that I did not show or talk about here, apparently. I mean... If I'm being honest, I'm just glad the dude's finally cleaning up his room. You know, I really don't want to, like, make it out like this guy will never seek help or anything. I mean, I really hope he does, because there's obviously something wrong. He needs to go to therapy or something. Like, there's very clearly a problem here that needs to be addressed. Anyways, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. So thank you for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're brand new around here on my channel. Follow me over on Twitter at Subtoptimus. I post memes, thoughts, and updates over there. It's a surefire way to get notifications of all my newest content. Join the Discord down below. Lots of great things going on down there. Thank you to my channel members for your $5 a month. Your support helps my channel tremendously. And until my next video, guys, this is Optimus, not cleaning his room for 15 years, and signing out.